Dolphins. What the hell is this? I don't know. Looks like miles or something. We'll get it back to engine. Maybe they know what it is. You guys on me.
Holy shit. Holy crap, is Holy it shit. nice to see you? Yeah, it's good to see you too, man. Oh. The rescue team here yet? We are the rescue team. How are we getting out of here? Uh, well, you're supposed to have a Jeep run every about 10 miles. Uh, about due west that way. But we better go ahead and uh, get out of here. Get the way, man. All right, let's go. Guys, we gotta go. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. started when I was nine years old and I saw the movie for the first time in theaters. Um, it completely blew my mind and changed the way I looked at film. Uh, since then I've been utterly obsessed with the franchise and being a fan of the movie has brought me in touch with so many great people I've met over the past few years. It's when I grew up as a kid. I, when the, I was like about five or six years old and when the movie came out uh, I just fell in love with the, the, fa well, the fantasy of it, you know, so um, that's what I loved about it. So I fell in love with Jurassic Park after my mom got me the, the VHS of it. And as a little kid, I used to just watch it over and over because only VHS I had. So I would just watch the movie over and over. I was about four years old, and I remember going to see Jurassic Park in the theaters. It was during that phase of my life where I was already in love with dinosaurs. And when I saw them appear on the screen for the first time, just hearing those words, welcome to Jurassic Park. It, it cemented my love for dinosaurs, for the franchise, and later on in life when I fell in love with Jeeps after getting my first one. It just, it captures you. It's the sense of adventure, the sense of wonder, and just the sense of exploration, and of course, just the amazing dinosaurs in themselves. And of course, we have the Jeeps here from Jurassic Park Motor Pool, really cool, and um, it, just, it just encapsulate adventure, history, prehistoric, it's all en encapsulating. So that's, I, I think that's why I fell in love with Jurassic Park. Hi, and welcome to uh, the photo shoot uh, backstory here. Uh, my name is Alan Douglas, and I'm one of the, the three founding members of Jurassic Park Motor Pool, uh, along with Manny Chen and Ari Bazin. Uh, we founded the Motor Pool because uh, we like Jurassic Park, we like the movie, we like the fact that uh, when we saw the movie, we wanted to make those Jeeps because they looked cool. Uh, so we founded the Motor Pool with three members, and now we're up to 110 members, with different vehicles from all around the world. Uh, including the big RV from the, the second movie, which is the Lost World Jurassic Park. Uh, we have vehicles from all kinds of different walks of life. Uh, we have Ford Explorers, and we have Mercedes-Benz, and we have a, a monster truck, you name it. But how we got involved with uh, this particular shoot is uh, we actually met uh, Gregory Wong at the WonderCon and the Long Beach Comic Expo, and uh, he asked to have us involved. And we love to be involved because we call this Cars Play which is cosplay for vehicles, and so we thought, let's get involved, let's uh, share uh, our different passions for cosplay and vehicles. And today we did it. We went up in the mountains in Santa Ana, and we decided to film our very own Jurassic Park slash Jurassic World video shoot, and it came out great. It was really, really fun. All right, so I just got killed. I had to kill the Asian guy first, didn't you know? <laughs> Honey Badger is like, they're killing all the Asians! Boom operator. <laughs> you ever chased a raptor before? He's <laughs> just like chicken. Oh my god. <laughs> you can see him struggling. He's just like, I don't want to. Oh, fuck it. I'll just go. <laughs> I'll just get that. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come <laughs> on. That was good though. Well, don't fall. Okay. Stop the grab-ass. Shit, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> I said stop. I said stop the grab-ass. Stop the grab-ass. Grab yeah. yeah, but haven't you done?